If you are struggling on finding new transition to do, oh, I am. then I'm here to help. In this series, I'm doing tutorials on random transition, so you're good. So if you're interested, and I know you are, keep watching the video. Now have your PC by your side and open After Effects. So this is the transition. So you should have two clips. Create a camera and add three adjustment layer linked to it. Make it 3D and same thing to the clips. And like always, we're just doing a quick zoom. Okay, now we're gonna start doing the transition. Yes! Finally! Start by setting the keyframe for the position in the second adjustment layer. Add CC page turn effect to the first clip. So as you can see you can now turn it like a page and that's why the effect called CC page turn. So to change its place to the left corner you just need to change this setting right here. Go to the beginning of the transition and set it to normal position. And create keyframe. Go to the end of it, and you see this point right here. Well, duh. Just hold it and drag it to the center of the clip. And as you can see, the second clip is not shown, so select it and drag it to the left. Add motion tile effect to cover uh, the black space. Now we need to create a small distance between the first clip and the second one. So increase the Z position of the second clip. Do you remember the second adjustment layer? We're gonna use it to zoom into the second clip. So don't forget to create a keyframe at the start and go to the end and zoom to the clip using the position values. When you're done, select the first two keyframes, then hold shift on the keyboard and select the other two and easy easy them. Open the graph editor and make sure it's a speed graph. And now match your graph with the beat mark you have like I do. And that's basically it. Let me just add a quick zoom out. And there we go, you can add checks or black bars or anything you want but I just showed you how to do the transition. So I hope you liked the tutorial, see you in the next video.